Because when I was five years old, I had to grow up quickly, mature, quick, so that I could get through this, get through the years, in fact. Um, so 7 to 11 were pretty much horrible years for me when I was in a um, boarding school and just didn't know what to do um, with any of the people that were really um, tarnishing almost my soul as such. I grew in years, I grew mature, I grew impish, I grew vicious. This is my teenager life now, and that was my attitude. Viciousness was my attitude towards life in general. I was a re rebel to my parents. I possibly, I was out there and doing all the bad, horrible things you can imagine here. Um, smoking, drinking, just being a rebel, um, rebellious teenager. Um, a horrible teenager, actually, for that matter. Um, didn't want to be around anyone, didn't want to know anyone. And these years were when I was from 16 all the way up till 18. Um, so I would look upon everyone as, one, as hate. All I had in my heart was hate for everyone. Um, and that made me more and more vicious. I turned to blood, I turned to bodies. I turned to humanity, I even turned to dignity. This is when I decided that I've had enough with my behavior or my attitude of hate towards people, and I wanted somebody to hear me out. And no one, um, no one actually heard me as the person that I was, and I really wanted somebody to just understand what I was going through so many years. And I even used to go to the temples and maybe sit there and cry for hours and think, why is this happening to me? I was harmed, I was crushed, I was broken, I was damaged. Um, and this is my university years now. So there was pressure all around. I had to be a, a degree holder. I had to be a good example to my sisters as I'm the oldest in the family, I had so many pressures of trying to keep myself free from all of these factors around me, bad company as such, that we say. Um, and I wanted to just stay away from. But finally, when I got to the university level, I was completely damaged um, inside. And then one day I grew a tongue, I grew a soul, I grew an entity, and I grew a personality. This is six years ago, when I finally was damaged. Um, somehow, somewhere, someone saw me. And that was the day they picked up me from this classroom and said, you, my dear, I have been working in mental health for 14 years. You are severely depressed and you don't even know. He said, what would you like me to do right now for you? And I said, there's nothing in this world you could do for me right now. He said, yes, I can. And he shifted me into the ambulance. I didn't want an ambulance, I didn't want to go to the hospital. And that was it. He sent me, he put me in the, in the ambulance and he sent me to Homerton Hospital. And I still remember the day I was sitting there almost as if a little baby is sitting in a mother's womb. I was sitting with my back against a wall and I thought to myself, what have I done to be here in this place? And then that's when I grew a tongue, like I said, and I grew a soul because a person sat next to me and spoke to me and told me and asked me. He heard me, he listened, he told me, spoken to me. However he did it, I don't know. But when I came out of all this, finally, I turned ecstatic, I turned scenic, I turned assertive, and now I feel I've turned out to be perfect.